All right, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. So as you guys can see, the car is here. We have made it back from Bonneville, but you guys are gonna be watching the footage at Bonneville. This is after. Now, I just wanna let you know that the filming may have not been the greatest ever. So some of it can be a little bit confusing, but I'm gonna jump in here and kind of explain to you guys as we go. So hope you guys enjoy the video. Let's get to the live action. Ready to go through tech? Your call, buddy. <laughs> Hopefully. Hopefully we're all ready to go. Looks like we're ready to go through tech. We're always ready to go through tech. The world record holding two. Wow. Yet to be decided. And all that yeah. stuff's tied on that side. You didn't mess with anything. No, all I did was I changed a couple for bolts. All right, let's go through tech. All right. Uh... Guess I'm in charge of holding the brake on this rig while we get towed down to tech. Come on guys, let's go. So while we're sitting here doing nothing, if you guys don't know anything about this car, it's a 1932 Ford. It's got a, what has it got? It's got a six cylinder GMC, 302 cubic inches with a little tiny supercharger on it down here. And that's pretty much it. It's got a dog box four speed transmission and hopefully it's gonna have a good tech sticker after we pass tech, but we'll see. Now the trick with this is that you gotta drag the brake enough to keep the rope there tight or else you'll go clunk, clunk, clunk. All right, gotta let you guys go and steer. All right, I got a three person job here. I'm holding the brake, trying to steer the car and not run into the back of the truck, but so far we're doing good. Salt looks really nice this year. There's some fast cars, the Speed Demon's pitted the Speed Demons pit had just kind of passed us, so maybe later we'll go take a look at their car. But in the meantime, let's make it to Tech first without any major incidents. God, this is a long drive just to get down to Tech. Just cruising along here. Whoa, guy's going a little too fast. Okay, Evan's hating on my glasses, so. No. Not good enough for you? No. No good? No point out. Okay, That's well, we're about, to, we're, about, we're about to go through Tech here and- I don't think we're- Tech's gone. Tech's gone. We're about to go fail tech. So we passed tech and now I'm gonna be going out for my first rookie run. Now your first rookie run, you were limited to under 149 miles an hour. So we got pretty close to that. We didn't go over and this will be my first rookie run here. <laughs>
What's the deal? Why are we not pulling fourth gear? Come on, come on, come on, come on. Let's go, let's go. Jesus Christ. Pull fourth gear. All right, you're getting nitro. Fuck it. Fuck it, fuck it. Put in fucking 30%. This is fucking bullshit. <laughs> yeah, you gotta watch that, but it's, oh, that's just practice. <laughs> I gotta You're coming turn, in a little hot. I gotta turn in the rear go. end kick. Well, go. oh shit! Yeah, were you using a brake at all? Yeah. Holy shit. Well, I stopped at like the one. I turned it off at like the one. You didn't go to the two? No. How come? That's 133. It was, it was like headed up to one four. I can't go. Well, you just you could maintain speed. I they want you to go to the two. No. Yes. He says you can go to the two. He says don't go past the two. Oh, Ron. I mean, I went, I coasted to the two. Did I? Oh, I don't know. It seemed like you were pulled off pretty quickly. I don't know. I just saw 133 and I shut it off. So, on your rookie pass, you're only allowed to go 150 miles an hour and you have to go past the two mile. The courses at Bonneville on the short course are three miles of full speed and two miles to shut down. And on the long course, you have five miles at full speed. And I think another five miles to shut down. And on my first rookie run, I did not go all the way through the two mile. So I had to redo it even though I went fast, even though I went under 125 and under 150 miles an hour. But unfortunately, the camera didn't record the second pass, but we went about 149 miles an hour on my actual rookie pass. Hey, Rocket, I put it in drive. Nice. Build up his uh, YouTube followers. Yeah, there you go. Listed as crewman. Sponsored by Paul Well, two one one. Okay, two. No, they didn't say anything. Oh. How we doing? We're doing good. How about you guys? Doing great. <laughs> Close up. My kid yeah, what's going on? Good. good. What do you do? I don't know. No You're... idea. The car was walking a little bit. Oh boy. It'll happen. Oh boy. It was. Is it day two or three? three Seven? Something. Day three? Yeah. Ready to go set a record? What the hell was that? You ready to go set a record? Are you ready to set a record? I'm ready. What do we got to go? We got to go 100 and. Let's do 160. You'll be fine. Do 160. Nice round number, huh? Yeah. You already went 150. 46. So we gotta go 160. 55? Even? What? 150 even? No, 160 even. Or 158 would do. 158, and we've qualified for our record. What's going on? What happened? Oh, what's wrong? There's something in the back.
I just shut the fuel off and, well, that's the right thing to do. Yeah, it didn't even, I mean, it, I let it go for a second thinking it might fix itself, but. Yeah, it was all spattery, huh? Yeah, I, I floored it and it's, no, 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 no. God damn it. <clears throat> oh. That was the record. No record, Ray? I don't think so. Oh boy. Another 12 hours of waiting. Hopefully this runs. So inform everybody of our current predicament. Uh, so it's 2,000 degrees. We made two runs yesterday. I did my rookie licensing. We made a pass at 146. And then this little doohickey right there with all the wires coming out of it took a crap on us. So right now we're working extremely hard to get it fixed, waiting <laughs> for it to come by carrier pigeon. And then we're gonna get it all fixed up, put in the car, and we're gonna go set a record. So in the meantime, we're just gonna wait around. Right? Yeah. Pretty much? Okay, so we're working hard right now. All right, so what's, what's the plan here? We changed the magneto and we're going to do what? Okay, very unresponsive crew here. We're going over to the barbecue place soon. Oh, to have oh, lunch. Really? We're forgetting all this nonsense about trying to get a record and just gonna go have lunch, huh? Barbecue record? So we fixed the Magneto. And we're waiting in line here, maybe four or five cars back. And we're gonna go out here and see how fast we can get the old girl to go. Oh, really? Is that what they do out there? I think that's what we do out here. So get ready, going for a run. <laughs> So at this point, the car was feeling really good and it pulled hard all the way up until fourth gear. And then as soon as we hit fourth gear, the car started laying over on itself and it just never came back. So you'll see what happened after the run.
What happened? Oh, who are you feeling? He's just stuck at 3,000 no matter what. Really? He didn't do anything. Are you sure it's not revving over there? You want a water? No, it's stuck in first gear. It wouldn't go past three. Ends up. Their motor is going past three. Really? Yeah. Cool. Well, well, you know, you just get you need some seat time. Got all this stuff in front of you. Let's just see what we're going to but it's probably wouldn't pull up because I probably shifted a little early, three, four. Well, that's very possible. I mean, when I, when things were going good and that was working right, I would shift. I would be. I knew I was at five thousand. I never. I didn't have any. It never seemed to go past three in any gear. Like the tack stopped at three. Yeah. I don't know what the fuck's up with that? Hmm. You should hop in it, Daddy. Because that was that was everything. It might go. Oh. <laughs> I should have screen recorded it, but you think that thing's gonna show it? No, I don't think it was on. I don't know how we always screw that up. Ooh. So the whole weekend, I don't know if we were down on power a little bit, but we ended up on the very last run. We seemed like we were a little low on power. And we came back. We actually wanted to change the rear gears here in the quick change from a 233 to a 248 and that would help the car pull up a little better but we took the number five spark plug out and saw it was covered in aluminum so currently we are sitting here and we have a burned up piston so we're gonna have to address that and get this thing ready before bonneville next year but we had a lot of fun and i hope you guys enjoyed the video if you did enjoy it don't forget to like and subscribe and we'll see you on the next one